chapter 1 nouns let me answer a what are nouns and examples b can you tell names locations objects in the physical world that refer to nouns learning time a parts of speech a group of words that expresses a meaningful sense is called a sentence if we study various words we find that they can be categorized into eight different places these categories of words or word clauses are known as parts of speech in english they are eight parts of speech noun pronoun adjective verb adverb preposition conjunction and interjection in this chapter we are going to learn about nouns b nouns naming words read the following sentences one the girl is reading the word girl is the name of a person two the giraffe is a tall animal the word giraffe is the name of an animal three this is a market the word market is the name of a place four she has a toy the word toy is the name of a thing in the above sentences girl giraffe market and toy are naming words naming words are called nouns let's learn a noun refers to the name of a person place animal or thing examples boy girl delhi chennai tiger elephant book pen etc practice time One identify the nouns in the following sentences and write in the space provided A Delhi is the capital of India answer Delhi India B New York is the largest city in America answer New York America C The Nile is a larger river in the Egypt answer Nile Egypt D The elephant is the largest land animal answer elephant animal e the shopkeeper sells rice sugar butter and tea answer rice sugar butter tea f kanika can speak english very well answer kanika g a bad workman blames his tools answer workman h the postman brings us letters answer postman i The earth moves round the sun. Answer: Earth, sun. J. My father bought books, pens, pencils for me. Answer: Books, pens, pencils. K. Apples, grapes, oranges are fruits. Answer: Apples, grapes, oranges. L. The Ganga is a holy river. Answer: Ganga. M Ruskin Bond is a great writer. Answer Ruskin Bond. N Rose, marigold, hibiscus are flowers. Answer Rose, marigold, hibiscus. O Gold, diamond, silver are ornaments. Answer Gold, diamond, silver. T A Circle the nouns in the following paragraphs. The sun is shining and the birds are singing. But Rahul is still in bed. Mom comes into the room. Rahul jumps out of bed, brushes his teeth, gets into the bathroom and is ready. Answer: Circle sun, birds, Rahul, mom, room, Rahul, bed, brush, teeth, bathroom. B. Underline the nouns in the following paragraphs. The kids in the school look after the plants in the garden. Plant need water. The kids bring water in their small watering cans. The boys and girls are little gardeners. I like watching the beautiful birds that come to the garden. Answer: Underline school, plant, garden, plant, water, water, cans, boys, girls, gardeners, birds, garden. Three. Solve the crossword puzzle with the hints given below. All the words you will find are nouns. A cross. One. If you take it daily, you can keep yourself away from the doctor. Three. It is the king of the forest. Four. You need these to chew your food. Five. It is the national bird of our country. Seven. It fears the cat. Down. One. It is a tiny insect. Two. It is the largest land animal. Six. It has webbed feet. Answer: 
Divide yourself. Fun with grammar. Divide the class into two groups. Ask them to label as many nouns as possible in the classroom in a fixed time period. When the time is over, ask each group to submit the list. The group which labels the most noun in the given time will be the winner. Divide the class into three groups. Assign these three places to one group each. School, drawing room, bus stand. Give five minutes to each group to write the nouns they can find at these places. The group that has listed the maximum number of noun wins. Teachers note, tell children how to identify a noun. For example, the boy sounds like a unit, so the boy is a noun. The chair sounds like a unit, so the chair is a noun.